This is the best AJ figure we've ever received from Mattel. And that is maybe a controversial statement, but I will stand by it. I don't think any other AJ Lee figure that came so close to capturing her and did such a cool costume, outfit, design, attire. Uh, it came close with the Walmart exclusive t-shirt series AJ. I thought that one did a really great job of capturing uh, her outfit, but the face was a bit lacking. But this face is the best face so far and looks like here. This is the back of the box, shows her super photoshops. Uh, whoever's doing their Photoshop, you should uh, lay off with the Photoshop makeup. It's blatantly obvious, bro. Even me, a simple uh, YouTube jobber reviewer, noticed that. All right, here we go. <clears throat> so it's safe to also assume that this is the last AJ Lee figure we will ever get. Unless there's like a secret t-shirt series or something like that. And my question is, do you think we'll ever see her like in PWG or something on the indies? Or do you think she's done with the wrestling industry? Because uh, she is now married to CM Punk, Phil Brooks, uh, Colt Cabana's good friend. And Colt is on the indies. CM Punk is doing... Uh, MMA, what's AJ doing? Nobody knows. Maybe maybe she'll uh, write. Maybe she will uh, become a famous chef. The world is her oyster as I see it. And um, to have a swan song of a figure, this is great. CM Punk's last figure was great. And I guess AJ Lee's last figure is great. And I'm gonna guess uh, Mattel knew this would be her last figure because they really busted out the quality here. The only problem I'm seeing is with her eyes. Uh, Mattel has been really uh, botching the, the eye decal placement and uh, it's not the worst but it's not the best because the left eye is like almost squinting. It's weird. I don't know. Dio's articulation is pff, vintage diva nonsense. You don't have much but it's nice that we have two cuffed hands instead of one open one. And this AJ figure is really tiny, really small. I wish I had my other AJs here to compare them, but uh, beggars can't be choosers. But I'll, I'll show her buddy Paige next door so you can see like the scale and the difference between them. Maybe, uh, oh, what a twist. That, that, that happened all the time. That's not really a twist. Um, sorry about that. I won't, I went nowhere faster than the speed of light. I don't think the shorts are new. I, I really like the decals on this thing though. That's, that's great. Mattel has really been hitting these divas out of the park, hitting home runs left and right, but uh, they really need to step up with their articulation. Um, I know they never will, uh, and uh, if they do, I will eat my words. Not, not really though. I'm not gonna actually eat them, but I will uh, say good for them, but like, why can't they bend their wrists? And why do they have the... Why can't they have an app crunch? I don't know. And why can't they double bend their knees? It's... It's really odd. What do you think? Do you think this figure is awesome like I'm saying it is? And a, a maybe the must-buy of the set? Let me know in the comments. This is Tommy saying thank you, nerds, for watching. Also, AJ Lee, um, if you're ever at PWG, thank you.